After hearing the interpretation of his dream from Daniel, King Nebuchadnezzar decided that he would like his kingdom to last forever. Not only will he build a statue completely of gold, but he will command everyone in his different provinces to come to bow to worship and honor his statue. Even though Daniel told me that my kingdom will pass, I will build my own statue. I will build my statue with complete gold and I will gather everyone to come and worship the golden image. So Nebuchadnezzar had his great golden statue constructed. Now that my statue is complete, I will gather everyone in all the provinces, all the governors, all the wise men, everyone to come, and I will have the musicians play. And at the sound of the music, they will bow down and worship my golden image and show honor to me. So everyone came to the site of the image at the king's request. I command everyone to bow and worship my statue at the sound of the music. Musicians. O oh, King, live, live forever. forever. We see three boys not bowing down. What? Three boys not bowing down? Can you point them out to me? In his rage, Nebuchadnezzar called for the three Hebrew boys. Come over here. You guys did not bow down to my golden statue. Maybe I should have the musicians play again so you can hear the music to bow down to my golden statue. Shadrach, Meshach, and the Bandico. And Sarvin said to the king, O oh, Nebuchadnezzar, we have no need to answer you in this matter. If that be the case, if that be the case, the God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace. And he will deliver us from your hands, O king. But if not, but if not, let me know to you, O king, that we do not serve your gods, nor we worship the golden image which you have set up. Let it be known to you, O king, we do not serve your gods. So you guys did not want to worship and bow to my statue? I've heated the fiery furnace seven times harder. I'll make an example of you guys to all nations, and everyone will fear me and know that my God is God. Guards, bind them. We will throw them into the fiery furnace. Didn't we throw three men into the fire? Yes. But I see four, and the fourth one looks like the Son of God. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego's God is able to deliver them from the fiery furnace. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, come out! Today I tell you, your God is the one true God. Let all Babylon bow down and worship the true God of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. I will worship your God. Then the king promoted Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in the province of Babylon. God is a mighty deliverer, a very present help in times of trouble. Those who put their trust in him and who honor him can call upon his name and he will deliver them out of all their troubles.
musicians play. At the sound of the music, I command everyone to bow down and worship my golden image. Action. Okay, live forever. We see three boys not bowing down. What? Three boys not bowing down? Can you point them out to me? <laughs> okay, okay, live, live forever. forever. We see three boys not bowing down. <laughs> You guys did not bow down to my statue. <laughs> Seven times hard to add uh, cast you into the fire. Didn't you tell me to refund? Yeah. All right. So let's go. All right. You ready? Action. So you guys are refusing to worship my statue. I've heated the fire, fiery furnace, seven times hotter. Chaldeans, bind them. We will throw them into the fiery pit. I'll make an example to you. Now wait. Oh, this is so nice. That's nice. <laughs>